All right, kids, that includes you, Julia. We're going to be tracking Santa all night long, so you get the kids in front of the TV. What kind of weather is Santa going to see when he gets here? He's going to be, he's going to be going like this. Wait a minute, Rudolph, did we take a wrong turn? It's going to be pretty warm here across southeastern Wisconsin. And as he tunes in to today's TMJ4 tomorrow, as he kind of rests a little bit, he's going to see rain across Wisconsin instead of snow. Here's a live look from our West Bend Tower Camp, Washington County. Lots of folks getting out and about, getting ready to celebrate with family and friends, either Hanukkah or Christmas. And you can see the snow left over from the last couple of weekends, which is a good thing. We'll have the white Christmas, but boy, oh boy. Tomorrow, some of that snow is going to wash away in your weather headlines. A soggy Santa if he sticks around southeast Wisconsin tomorrow afternoon. Toasty temperatures remain also going to help to melt some of that snow with whipping winds. Those winds are going to be quite strong starting tomorrow through Monday. Outside right now, well, we're nice and warm for this time of year, this time of the night. 37 in Milwaukee's Mitchell and even freezing in Waukesha. 33 in Watertown and Beaver Dam. 34 in West Bend. If you find folks joining us in Sheboygan, the wind's pretty quiet, so Rudolph should have no headwind to worry about as he sets down across your neighborhoods in southeastern Wisconsin. Notice up to our northwest, upper left part of your screen, 6 degrees right now in Minot, 17 in Fargo, 9 in International Falls, Minnesota. So much colder air mass there. Luckily, we're here. And so for now, we remain above average with those temperatures toasty near 40 degrees across parts of the center of the nation. Here's a look at the satellite and radar combination. We have low pressure anchored up to our north. That's deepening. Very strong storm system that's going to sweep through here with a cold front, but take its time getting through southeastern Wisconsin. Meantime, a good deal of cloudiness across our area. That cloudiness is going to remain through the nighttime hours tonight. Future forecast indicates as we go toward noon tomorrow, just an overcast sky. But watch what happens in the afternoon toward the evening hours. A big surge of moisture works its way toward us. Our temperature should be warm enough that it doesn't freeze on contact. So we're still looking at liquid precipitation around here. No snow, no freezing rain, but some steady showers as we head into tomorrow night and then clearing on Monday. So your storm team forecast for tonight, Christmas Eve, first night of Hanukkah, cloudy and warm, patchy fog out there overnight. Our temperature is down to near 31. For tomorrow, Christmas Day, first full day of Hanukkah, expect patchy fog in the morning, windy, very warm, all the way up to near 40 degrees with rain developing in the afternoon. Here comes your Storm Team 4 seven-day forecast. Get ready for a drop in the temperatures considerably. Now, on, on Monday, I expect we're going to start warm, near 41 degrees. But then, during the day, the temperatures fall. And Tuesday, we only rise to near 28 degrees, so much colder. And then, as we head toward... The middle of the week, we start to rise a little bit into the middle 60s. All right, hang on now. I gotta put my Santa hat on. And That's right. Because we, we gotta go to 